Based near Manila in the Philippines, Entel was established in 1995 and have grown to be a leading manufacturer of commercial grade two-way radios in the global market. Consisting of over 4,000 different parts, the production of the two-way radio is a long and detailed process, which all starts here, at the kitting department. Each component is checked by hand under Entel's strict quality standards before they can be moved into kitting boxes. Entel's sophisticated real-time tracking and inventory system provides the exact location of every part that comprises the build of these radios. To ensure this consistent level of performance at every stage of the manufacturing process, the various components of the radio go through stringent checks and verification. More than 500,000 lines of code are loaded by our automated test equipment. There are about 39 processes that make up the parts used on the digital radio, and developing and manufacturing the materials is definitely an extensive process. Production starts with electrical circuits. Each component is mounted directly onto the printed circuit boards, also known as PCBs, by precision pick and place machines. They then go through a series of heat zones where the components bond together with the board. The boards are then inspected by multiple forms of visual inspection, be it by hand, microscope and x-ray to make sure that even the smallest component is cleared before moving on. Next it's on to sub-assembly where lines of workers with individual roles now add the mechanical and electronic parts to the PCBs. These are dedicated lines that comprise of teams processing the electrical or mechanical assemblies. This helps with productivity and efficiency as one by one the lines can create the PCB for the mechanical keypads, frame and top covers, while the electrical assembly builds switches, encoders, mics and speakers. The intention is that the lines work together as a unit or one-piece flow. This way increases productivity. The new circuit boards are placed onto a fabricated metal frame, which will become the main body of the radio. They are secured and then carefully screwed together. New high impact polymer cases arrive on the production line. Some branding will be added before inserting the PCB and all external mechanical parts, such as the knobs. Users of handheld radio are many and varied and include clients in industries such as um, blue light, armed forces, petrochemical, utilities, shipping, uh, heavy industry, leisure and retail. Some hand portables available today use extremely power efficient silicon electronics. Um, this enables the use of compact and lightweight batteries. One of Entel's technology strengths is built around its own custom-designed and unique automated testing stations that ensure each and every radio is fully compliant to its test specifications. Before full assembly of the radio, each board serial number is scanned, calibration data applied and the board tested. The board serial number, together with its test results, are then automatically uploaded to the manufacturing database. There are many advantages of handheld radios. Handheld radios don't rely on third-party infrastructures to provide coverage and therefore can be deployed anywhere. They provide instantaneous group communications at the press of a button, which eliminates the need to set up a conference call or wait for the phone to ring and then be answered. This form of instantaneous group communication is essential to users such as the UK Fire Service, one of the many emergency armed and government services worldwide that use Entel radios for critical communications. Because they don't rely on third-party hardware, handheld radios don't have the airtime, call or data fees associated as do mobile phones. No matter how many calls are made, text messages sent or data used, when using handheld radios you have a fixed, low-cost system. After a series of automatic tests, it is now time for final assembly of the radio. Entel produces its own batteries and accessories. Here we see two high-capacity lithium-ion cells being verified and assembled into a battery pack using a spot welding machine. Once the main body has been assembled, it is time for final testing of the completed radio. Entel's automated test station identifies the radio model being built, then downloads the test script from the production database. The radio is connected inside the test unit and the system automatically picks data from pre-assembled tests. 
tunes the radio and adds all necessary firmware. The results are instantly shown on a monitor, so the operator can view its performance. Once passed, a unique label is printed, which will go with the radio to the packaging area. The special label gives all the information needed, so the batteries and any accessories can be placed into its presentation box, sealed and sent out for shipment. The walkie-talkie, truly a wicked invention.